guys, welcome to my channel. Um, if you don't know who I am, my name is Cece. I'm the Green Goddess. Why am I the Green Goddess? Because I um, love our environment. I love plants. I love money. I have something kind of special just because my birthday's coming up soon. So I'm sure you guys know that from my Pisces video. Um, my birthday comes up at the beginning of March. So I wanted to show you guys uh, my birthday look for this year. I think I'm going to do some pink and green, um, some green goddess green and some nice uh, CC girl pink. Brows, tinted brow mascara. It's from Shop Miss A. Urban Decay, some of their primer, so I'm really excited to use this. This one is the anti-aging one, to be honest. Um, I'm not aging, so I usually wouldn't use something like this, but it's a sample, and it's honestly my last Urban Decay sample. I already had all the good ones. And I absolutely loved all of them, so I'm going to use the anti-aging for you, folks. I love these Urban Decay primers. Um, when I could afford one, I want to buy one. Because they're so soft, they're so moussey. Like this one right here already feels so soft and moussey, and it's anti-aging, so that's probably why it's so creamy. The green colors, I'm going to go into my old Morphe palette using some of these greens, and I'm also using this Sephora color. It's called Mojito Green. I love this color just because it has sparkles, and honestly, it's one of my spirit colors. Literally, if I could pick a green goddess green, this would be one of the closest that I've found. I'm just going to go in with some black. Um, this is going to help to accent the line when I do a cut crease. It's also going to help accent the green. The black with some more of that mojito green. Electric Urban Decay palette. I'm going to be using this green. cut crease. I just used some normal um, concealer today. I didn't use any pomade or anything. Just wanted to keep it a little bit more simple. But it did a really good job with that concealer I used. For that Morphe palette, I'm going to go ahead and use this pink right here. One of my favorite pink colors. My Urban Decay Electric palette. Going to use some Savage as well. Morphe palette. And I'm going to apply that there to the winged area. And then I'm going to go in with that Savage because it's a bit lighter. All that pink on both sides and I'm also starting to put it here on the under eye. A few palette for the under eye using that darkish pinkish color. The Savage is a bit too light for that one. Love that color. A palette using this green. And I'm just gonna go back on top of, um, with the green using the sparkly pink. Yes, my goddesses, I am using the chocolate gold palette for this. Looking very sparkly, shiny. Put two little concealer lines right there at the front of my eye because I'm going to go ahead and highlight that with some glitter. I'm going to go in with this Kat Von D highlighter kit first because it has this emerald green that I love using. And I'm going to go ahead with this skinny little brush and just apply that right here. Pretty much got this left eye finished. I went ahead and got that green right there in the front, the greenish whitish. And then um, I got that glitter wing going. This cheap brand, I got it from Shop Miss A. But look at how good it ended up working just for this nice pink look I got. Using the chocolate gold palette, I'm going to be using Rich Girl. Lash. I'm just doing my bottom lashes for right now.
Gotta love that mascara face. Now I'm gonna try to apply some fake eyelashes. Um, I feel like you guys know I'm not the best at this, but I'm getting them set right now. Use this type of lash glue. Black adhesive dark. Um, using my little lash holder and I'm waiting for it to dry so we'll see how this goes. I did get both of my fake eyelashes on. Yes, it did take me about 15 minutes. Now I'm just fixing it up with the roller lash mascara. So I went ahead and got off those tapes. I'm pretty happy with the results. Concealer as earlier. I'm gonna go ahead and mark up my face with that. NYX foundation. I'm going to use it with this little speckle brush. Mm -hmm. I got my foundation on. I'm looking very white in this lighting, but trust me, it is my color. I use the... Which one is it? Light Ivory. This um, sculpting kit. I'm going to be using this color right here. Just using a normal angled contour brush. Fetish palette using the dark pink, my favorite. Fifteen minutes of blending. I feel like I got it to my standards. Once again, I know it looks really light. It must be the lighting I have right now. But um, I got all that blush on. Got that contour on. Using this pomade, it's from um, Shop Miss A, that really cheap website. I'll go ahead and put this side on for you guys. Um, I honestly like this for it being a cheap pomade. It's working really well. Um, it's actually a little darker than what I usually use, but I really like um, the way it's outlining my brows. The only thing I would say is it's not as good as um, like Anastasia's at sculpting the brows along with tinting them, but if you have them already sculpted, this works really well. And literally it's only a dollar, so might as well. I need to brush those out in the front. They're looking a bit thick, but it's because I'm using a darker pomade than I usually use. Um, but they, it sculpted them out really well. I also went thick because I wanted a big arch today, so this is what we're working with. I'm putting on some highlighter for my fetish palette using Rose Shock. So this is my final product. I got my birthday dress on. Looks like I'm ready to party. Um, got my little strawberry earrings on. That's what's bringing that green and pink all together. And I went ahead and used this lipstick. I think we all know which lipstick this is because it's pretty much famous. And look at the shine. It's matching my eyeshadow. I am feeling very happy about this makeup look. Pretty today. Please hit that bell. Um, I really, really want to hear from you guys, so please um, share in your comments, advice, um, maybe what you liked, what you didn't like. I really love hearing from you folks. The look would be complete without a crown. I do have a few different crowns because I feel like I'm a queen. I feel like I'm a princess. for spending part of my birthday with me I really appreciate you thank you so much um, for supporting the green goddess because I need some support 
giveaway soon because I think that if I should be getting birthday gifts, you guys should be too. So just check up for details on my Facebook and on my Insta about how you guys could win that um, giveaway.